everyone in this video I will show you how to make this uh, slippers or booties uh, it's so simple and uh, uh, cozy I hope you like this ones and for these ones I use lime brand yarns uh, wool is thick and quick it's size 6, super bulky yarn, and it recommends a 9mm crochet hook, but I want to make them a little tight, uh, so I use 6mm crochet hook. And I use uh, two and a half balls of this yarn and one ball of this one 170 grams 106 yards and 97 meters uh, you can ca calculate it like that I made this ones for size 37 38 or 39 it fits uh, all of them cause uh, as I explained it with your that's so um, elastic because I use the ribbing uh, front post and back post double crochets if you want to make it bigger or smaller uh, I, I explain how to make it uh, at the video uh, and uh, if you have any question about then please leave comments uh, if you are ready please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and let's start At first, we will make the sole. Start with a slip knot and make 19 chains. Nineteen and yarn over, turn back and skip these three uh, chains into that fourth chain. Insert, grab the yarn, yarn over and pull through, yarn over and pull through, make a double crochet, and into same place make two more double crochet. That's one. Two. Starting from the next chain, make double crochets. I will totally make uh, 14 double crochets. I made my 14 double crochets and into this last stitch I will make 7 double crochets. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Now we turn here, starting from the next stitch into this same chain we made our double crochet. Make a double crochet and into the next one make a double crochet. Use this double crochet, insert in the same place and make one more and make 14 again and 
And when you complete your 14 double crochets that you count, yes, there is one stitch left that's our beginning stitch. I will make three double crochets here. One, two, three. And into the third chain, insert your hook and uh, join with a slip stitch. That's the end of the first row. Chain three and into the same place make one more double crochet. And starting from this next one, make make this three time. One and two double crochet into same place. Into the next one. Two double crochets. Into the next one. Two double crochets. And now we will make six half double crochets. Yarn over, insert your hook into the next stitch, grab the yarn. Yarn over and pull through from all these loops. That's the half double crochet. Into the next one, half double. Three, four, five, six and into this uh, next nine stitches we will make single crochets. Insert your hook, grab the yarn, yarn over and pull through. Two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. For here, we will make half double crochets. Two half double crochets into same space uh, six times. I will show you now. Insert into this first one. One and two half double into the next one. One, two. Next one, one, two. Next one, one, two, three, four times. One and two, that's five and six. And now we will make, uh, sorry, uh, nine single crochets. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, and nine. Then six half double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, and six. And into this next two spaces, make one and two double crochets into the next one two double crochets again and into this first one join with a slip stitch we totally have one two three four five six two double crochets here 
six half double crochet nine single crochet six half the uh, two half double crochet into same stitch nine single crochets six half double crochets okay start with three chains and into same place make one more double crochet into this next stitch here make a double crochet only one into the next one make two double crochets next one only one double crochet next one two double crochets next one only one double crochet and for the last time two double crochets two one two one two one two we will make this two uh, double crochet into same stitch totally four times And starting from the next stitch, make seven half double crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Starting from the next, make ten single crochets. One, two, three four five six seven eight nine and ten into this next stitch make two single crochets into the next one make one single crochet into the next one make two single crochets one two single crochets one and for the last time make two single crochets starting from here I will make ten single crochets nine and ten by the way i made totally one two three and four time this two single crochets into same place and now i will make seven half double crochets one two three four five six seven into this next make two double crochets next one one double crochet next two double crochets one double crochet and two double crochets and for the last time one double crochet and we are at the end of this sole just leave this loop loose this loop and cut the yarn grab a yarn needle I will close here now but 
I will insert my needle not into here. Okay? Not into this chain, not into this first stitch, into this second stitch. Insert here. And insert it into this last stitch. And hide this yarn. Why I made this like that? Uh, because I need um, multiples of two uh, stitches. Uh, this way I have 64, totally 64 stitches, but I will count one more time and turn. Yes, I have 64, totally 64 stitches. That's um, Twenty four uh, and twenty four and a half centimeters. This uh, fits a uh, thirty seven, thirty eight, thirty nine for European, uh, and it's a US size seven eight, uh, UK size five six. You can call it like that. Uh, because this is so elastic, it will fit this both size. And if you want to make it a little smaller, maybe for uh, 36 size, uh, you can use a smaller crochet hook, maybe 5 mm crochet hook, and make it a little small. Um, or uh, you can find uh, sole uh, tutorials on YouTube. You can use any of them for this booty. Um, only thing is, only important thing is here, you must have an even numbers of stitches around it. If it's okay, that's okay. You can use a different uh, sole too. Now we will make the uh, upper part just hold here you see that's the front side that's the back side and this is the right side of my work and that's the wrong side of my work take this back side and find the middle stitch just go here I think that's the middle stitch Insert into this back loop, only back loop. Wrap this yarn, pull it. Chain two, insert into same place and make a double crochet. Into the next one, insert into back loop. By the way, I am hiding this yarn too. Insert here. Make a double crochet. Into the next one. Make a double crochet. Next. Make a double. Now I will just keep going like that. Just put one double crochet for all the stitches you have and only use back loops. Uh, 
just go ahead and finish this row. I complete the first row and join from this first stitch not into this chain. Okay, we will not count this as a double crochet or something. Join here. Chain two again and starting from here we will never count this chain two as a double crochet. And now we will make front post and back post double crochet. So how to make them. Insert your hook. That's my two chain and that's my first double crochet. Insert my hook between them around this double crochet. I will uh, make it like that. Just grab the yarn and make your double crochets. And around the next one, I will ma make a back post double crochet yarn over. This time, insert my hook from back to front and around this double crochet, give it the back again. Okay, it will look like that. Grab the yarn and make a double crochet. Around the next one, make a front post. Around the next one, make a back post. Make a front post, make the back post, front post, and back post. And just go ahead and make one front pose, one back pose for all the double crochets you have. I'll see you at the end. And that's the last back pose double crochet. Into this first stitch, join with a slip stitch. Chain two and start with front pose double crochet, then make back pose double crochet front post and back post front post back post just keep going like that and when you reach the front side here wait for me okay I'm here now I'm in front and we will find the middle one again and that's it middle uh, front post double crochet okay just go like that or you can find it like that that's the middle one okay and leave this one and this one, we will make three front post double crochet together with them. And here I will make one back post double crochet. Then I will make three front post double crochet. Yarn over, insert here, grab the yarn. Yarn over, pull through only one time and leave it like that. Don't make anything here, just skip this back post double crochet into this next front post double crochet, make a half, skip next back post double crochet and into the next one, make a half. I have four loops on the hook, yarn over and pull through from all these loops. And starting from here, make your back post 
and front post double crochets. I'll see you at the end. I'm at the end of the row. I will join with a slip stitch, chain two, and make your front post and back post double crochets. I'll see you here. I made a back post double crochet and that's my three front posts together. And that's the uh, front post double crochet before this one. I made this back post and now I will make three front posts together again. That's the first one. Skip this back post and around this insert your hook from here like that. Make a half of a double crochet. Skip this back post double crochet and around this next front post double crochet make a half and complete them together then make up make a back post double crochet front post double crochet and we will just keep making like that for how many rows i'll show you I made one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight time. Totally eight time. And we made two right now. We will make six more. We will just make the same thing uh, for uh, six more rows. Uh, for the other row, we will take this one first, this one, then here, then here, and make three front posts together. This three. Just keep making like that, and I'll see you at the end. I made totally eight times. Uh, this decrease and now we will make two more rows without decrease of course if you want you can make more rows here you can make it longer as you want I, uh, but I think uh, two rows will be enough I'm just making my double crochets. I'm here now. I will make a back post double crochet and here make a front post make a back post and front post keep doing like that and then when you finish this row make a one more row make a front post here okay make these two rows and I see you I complete two rows, as you see, and we will make a, a final touch now. Just chain one and we will make craft stitch. Just turn back into this last stitch here. Hold uh, this loop with your finger. Insert into this last stitch. Wrap the yarn, 
pull it and make a single crochet. Hold this loop, insert into this next stitch here. Take this yarn, make a slip stitch, uh, sorry, single crochet. Insert into the next one, make a single crochet. Insert here. And just turn around the uh, booty like that. I'm at the end and that's where I start. I will insert here, take the yarn and make a slip stitch. Lose this loop and cut the yarn. Just take this yarn inside of it and grab a yarn needle. Cut the yarn. I hope you like these booties. If you like, please don't forget to push the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Sirin's Crochet is my Instagram, Pinterest and website address. You can reach me in any of them. And that's it for today. Hope to see you again. Have a nice day.